Welcome back. Um, since the last video I did, which was the Tac Force Duo, I've gotten a few more. Um, I'll try to give them in order, and I think it started with. So I remember the last video I did covered all the knives I had at the time, except for maybe this one, which I'll just show you real fast. This is a McCoy Knife Company. Uh, so it's a McCoy knife. It's one they stopped making about 30 years ago. 15. 30, somewhere in there. Since I play guitar, Mount Ida right there. Uh, since I play guitar, I thought this was a nice little piece. Mother of Pearl. Kind of a faded look. I just kind of thought it was a nice collector's piece, so I got it. Cost me a pretty penny though. So. Kind of wish it had been cheaper, but you know, I can't make them put a certain price on something. So it would be nice at times. Okay, and then I've had that one for two years now. And then after I got them taken, which I'm getting them back slowly by means of sneakiness, um, is this. It's a Kershaw Spring Assist or Assisted Open, whatever you want to call it. Speed safe is what it says under it. Uh, other side of the blade. There's China down here. And all that wonderful stuff. Got a really short, uh, or relatively short, pocket clip. Which makes it easier. But it's a really good clip and it stays on. So, you know, I'm not complaining. It is a really fast knife. Uh, I've also sharpened it very well, um, too well, too too good, whatever you want to say, um, so get that out of the way. I'm trying to make a shorter video than normal. I got this from my grandparents for Christmas. This one was from my cousin. Uh, this Columbia Multi-Tool with work cutters, pliers, an LED. Yeah, kind of bright. Sorry. Let's see that effect again. Anyway. Uh, I don't know why when they say the fun number of functions on a multi-tool, they include the little clip or something that you can attach to your key ring or whatever. That doesn't make sense to me. Anyway. It's got a little blade. It's nothing special. Um, it's got a little saw, bottle opener, screwdriver, other screwdriver. Just kind of rinky dink. Has a light. That's about it. So, and then my Paul gave me this for my birthday. It is an Uncle Henry knife, a trapper. Move that out of the way. It's really. Nice looking. A little dirty, but you know. Both of the blades I have sharpened. They're quite sharp. Probably too sharp for this knife. Trapper blade. Regular blade. So. I mean, it's a it's a good knife. I don't carry it very often. Uh, maybe to church, just because it's it's more of a special knife to me. Wow. Of course, it's got the uh, Uncle Henry right there. Anyway, so that's my most recent ones. I just kind of wanted to catch up and get y'all in on the info and all that. So as if you want to listen to the radio station here, go to rock106.net. All aboard! <laughs> I think that's it for today. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you around.